freshly arrived in Goa, in the southwest of India. Today we decided to do a little bit of a special thing, I guess. It's been a few weeks now that we eat Indian food, morning, lunch, dinner. So we decided today to try something new and go to McDonald's. And as you might know, in India, eating beef and also pork is something that is usually restricted. And McDonald's does not serve any burgers with pork nor with beef. We expect to have quite a bit of a different experience than what we have usually in Europe. So yeah, can't wait to try it. Let's go. Okay, so let's see what they have here. Let's take a look at the different burgers and wraps. And let's try a few different things. I okay, mac cheese, veggie, so. mac spicy paneer, mac veggie, corn and cheese. So, okay, so these are the, the veggie ones. Let's just take a look at the non veggies. So they have mac chicken, grilled chicken and cheese. I would love to try the Maharaja mac. That's like the Indian equivalent of the Big Mac. Let's see actually what, what drinks they have. Ooh. Salad pop coke. Oh, they have so much choice here. Lemon chiller. Yeah. Fanta float. Are they actually putting like some kind of ice cream? I'm gonna try the chili guava sprite. Add to order. <laughs> Cheesy bag nuggets. Add to order. <laughs> Pizza on my cup. That looks great. Let's try to make spicy premium chicken. Add to order. stuff. <laughs> no idea how we're gonna finish all of this, but I'm super excited to try some new stuff. Here it seems like McDonald's is way more of a kind of a premium thing because people go to McDonald's more for an experience, right? It's like a Western fast food, so it's not the typical food that they eat every day. So you can see that it's actually definitely cleaner than your typical American or uh, European McDonald's. Also, it's pretty funny because we've seen in the other cities where we've been in the north of India, we've seen that there's way less McDonald's stores that you would find usually in cities in Europe. Like in Europe, you would find McDonald's literally on every corner. Here, it's way more rare to find some. This is what your face looks like when you've ordered way <laughs> too much food. <laughs> oh my God, there is really a lot. And actually, there was a little mistake made and two of these uh, egg thingies were, uh, were ordered. So yeah, wish us luck. What do we start with? Um, I mean, I say we have to start with yes. the Maharaja Mac. Yes. I think there is like jalapenos or peppers and well, let's go. Cheers. Mm. Okay. Mm. Interesting. It is very different than the Big Mac chicken. And the sauce is different. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Christ. I don't so know. It's not the typical Big Mac sauce? Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that looks so good. Mm. Let me get a bite. So now it's my turn for my first bite of this uh, Maharaja Mac. What the inside kind of looks like. Mm. It doesn't have at all the taste of a Big Mac. Mm. No. But it is so good. It's very good. It is really good. It's, very good. it's really spicy as well. Okay, now we have this second burger here. I like the way it's presented already. It's a bit different than the, the Big Mac. I mean the Maharaja Mac. Oh, there's some egg in there. The bread is very different. Try that. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Mm. It's insane. This is an insane burger. Wow. Mm. Oh wow. Mm. This one is good, right? Mm -hmm. And the bread is. Um, it's a bit like the muffin bread that they have. It, it is. It is actually. It is. Mm, this one is so good. Mm -hmm. mm. I prefer this one over the Mahar Jamak. The Mahar Jamak is good, but this one. Yeah. This one is really wow. tasty. So far we've only tried the non bag burgers, but we still have the bag burgers left. And there is one that I'm going to try right now, which is the Mac Alu Tiki Burger. So there we go, this is what it looks like. Hmm. It tastes very veggie, like it tastes like veggies basically. Yep. So it's not necessarily something that I would retake personally, but it's an interesting taste. Good to try. Okay. Go. Also gonna get it by myself. Mm. What do you think? It tastes a lot like, you know, samosas. Mm -hmm. 
Instead of the samosas here, it's the same thing, I think, that you have in the veggies. Yeah, I think it's also, in the samosas, it's also potato with some kind of veggie mix, I think, and that's similar to yeah. this, probably. I'd say it's good, it's good. Yeah. It's not like my favorite one so far, but it's very good. Okay, we've tried most of the burgers that we have here. There's one left though, which is the Mac Egg Burger, and by accident we ordered two of them. So it's basically a burger bun with egg and some sauce on it. Let's give it a try. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, very good. Yeah? Mm -hmm. It is really good. It's like as if you would go to Europe, you say, I just want a quick bite, I'm gonna get a cheeseburger. Here you get to make egg. It's very similar to an uh, Egg McMuffin. I mean, for me, it just lacks a little bit of something, I don't know, more crispy or whatever, you know. Oh, and we also oh, have our nice uh, <laughs> sauces arriving here. Thank you so much. Thank you. Is it good? Mm. It's Can extremely good. It we've made a massive mistake because actually what they do is they give you a shake shake bag and this bag is made so that you can put your fries or your McNuggets in there and then add piri piri sauce and then you can basically shake it you shake the fries and the spices and then you can enjoy your piri piri fries or your piri piri nuggets so yeah for uh for next time although First drink test, we have the chili guava sprite here. It definitely looks really good. Mm. That is amazing. Oh, I love it. Nice. Similar to strawberry, I would say. Kind of lemonade taste, and you have a very tiny bit of spiciness because of the chili that's in there. Nice. So you I recommend? I definitely recommend. Nice. Okay, so let's go. Chili guava sprite. Wow. Wow, it's super good. Oh, it's amazing actually. You do indeed have like this kind of like strawberry feeling but with the spiciness of the, the chili flakes. I love it, I love it. Such a good drink. Okay, it's time to try the second drink. This is, what is this, the floating, floating Coke? Coke floats, Coke, Coke floats. Float. So I didn't know if it was ice cream or whipped cream. Yeah. Let me try this. It's kind of like ice cream. But it tastes good. It's, it's really good, it's it really tastes, good. It tastes like a more creamy Coke. Uh, so actually I think this is it's just Coke that was mixed with the ice cream probably. Mm. It's good. That's a good idea. Yeah, it's <laughs> great. It's like adding two things together that are amazing by themselves mm. to make it even better. This is the masala pop coke. It is very interesting. It's literally you mix chili sauce and coke together. I mean, masala in the end is spicy, right? So wouldn't necessarily drink it every day though. Not like the other one. You know what it tastes like? Mm -hmm. For those of you that know, it tastes like canned ratatouille. Like in France, we have ratatouille, obviously, and you can put it in cans, and it has al always a little bit of a different taste than a fresh one, and it tastes actually like that. Ratatouille from a can? Why not? I'm proud of us. We actually managed to finish everything, surprisingly. We ordered so much, but we managed to finish everything. Then we only have the drinks left. Out of all the burgers, I, I wish we had tried more, but I think my favorite one, by far, the Mac Spicy, was really, really good. Like, good balance between the spice, the, the bun was actually really nice, with this kind of like muffin type of bun, and the crispy chicken, amazing. And my least favorite one, I would say like the Mac Egg thingy. It was great, like, it, it's, it's just like a normal thing with egg inside, it's just like kind of boring. My favorite burger is also the Mac Spicy. Just like you all, I don't know, it's just really good. And the least favorite, I think, for me is the McAlu Tiki, the one where we have the potato, veg, uh, patty in the middle. It was not bad, but it was not necessarily into the taste that I actually like, and I would not necessarily retake it. Okay, so we concluded our McDonald's India experience. In a few sentences, what was your impression of it? Pretty good, honestly, pretty good. Better than I thought it would be. 
and very different in a way than how it is in Europe and the US. Where at the end of the day, like in Europe and the US, I feel you have a lot of the same burgers. Here, almost the whole menu is different. I mean, of course you have a few similarities, but the whole menu is different. True. And obviously, I mean, that's for cultural, religious reasons. But that's interesting to see that they've adapted very well to this specific market in a way. I agree, I agree. And especially it's nice to see that they have specific types of spices that they frequently use in Indian dishes. So even if you would go to an Indian restaurant, you would find similar flavors and spices. So that's really, really nice. So overall, I think we can say it was a pretty good experience. Yeah, if we don't uh, die <laughs> we don't in get run car. over by a car. That was a pretty good experience. So we would definitely recommend if you have the chance if you're in India to go to a McDonald's. Yeah, but if you have the time, uh, don't put this in number one priority <laughs> list in India. I mean, there's like really, really good restaurants, insane Indian cuisine. So, you know, if you have the time, go to McDonald's, but this is not uh, Absolutely, the and that's the one reason uh, why we did the video to show you what it looks like so that you don't necessarily have to do it. But if you want to do it, it's worth it because it is very different. And with this, I would like to say thank you for watching and we will see you again very soon. We're going to enjoy the beach now in our last few days. And come on and subscribe and uh, hit the bell. Exactly. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> see you.